tonight in Keithley. Corin. Good evening, Amanda. Well, it's the end of a really busy day, at the end of a very busy week here at Silsden Medical Practice. This is their vaccination clinic where they've been seeing hundreds of people a day. Now, there's been a big uptick here in the number of people coming forward for their booster vaccinations following that announcement by the Prime Minister that all adults should be offered their booster by the end of January. But the process of getting a vaccination isn't straightforward for everyone. So the modality partnership which runs this practice, along with several others in the area, has been working with community organisations to make sure that the booster jabs and the vaccinations reach everyone who needs them. Uh, well, we'll hear more in a moment about just how busy the Christmas period is going to be here. But uh, first, let's hear from some of the people who came through for their booster vaccines today, uh, but also some younger teenagers coming through for their first jab. There are lots of volunteers here making this process run smoothly, looking after people in the car park along with retired GPs, retired dentists, physios, surgeons who have all uh, volunteered to come in and help deliver some of the vaccines. So uh, let's speak to some of the people who have responsibility to, for making sure it all runs very efficiently and very swiftly indeed. Faye Milbourne is the vaccine coordinator here at Silson Medical Practice. Um, Faye, just tell me, it's, hasn't it, people yeah, coming through? appointments. <laughs> Three minute day. appointments, that's yeah. incredible. <laughs> well, Lois Brown is the practice manager. Um, Lois, uh, just thank you very much, Lois and Faye. Well, you may be wondering, when is it going to be my turn? Uh, just like with the first uh, phase of the vaccination programme, we'll be, they'll be working through the priority groups and uh, you're advised to wait until you are called forward. Corinne, thank you very much.